Today we're looking at the black cat rat trap. So some parts about the trap, you've got this catch at the top here, the bait spike here, and the kill bar at the front here. This is a very strong trap. The, the catch at the back here controls the, the bait spike. And when we compare it to a, a traditional rat trap here and a mouse trap, we can really see the size of the trap. Um, it's got a unique design. So we need some solid bait. Here we're using chocolate. You can use apple or anything else that, that, that's gonna attach to this spike here. And we press the spike down and this is the part of the food that the rat is gonna take away that activates the trap. The catch at the top here needs to be pushed in the forward position. And now we are going to just to fill the bait trough with some loose feed. Um, so in this case, we're using muesli. And what we're aiming to do here is to get the rodents, the rats feeding from this food source. And then eventually one of the rats is going to take uh, or try to take away the solid food that we put on the spike. At this point, the trap will be activated. So now we're gonna set the trap. So we've got the catch in the right position and the kill bar is gonna move in this arc here. It's really important that we keep our fingers away once the trap is set. So holding firmly with one hand, we're gonna put our fingers into this loop here and pull the kill bar until it fits into the catch here. You should hear it clicking. The trap is now set and it's really, really important. This is a powerful trap that our fingers do not enter this kill area here. Um, also for non-target animals, we shouldn't be entering that area. Um, so when the trap is set, the rat will move the, uh, the chocolate in this case and the kill bar will come down and capture any rats that are currently feeding from any of the food in the bait trough. When we look at the trap from, from the rear angle, uh, we can see how it's set. So we're pulling back that kill bar, it's catching on. And if we are very careful, what we're gonna do is to demonstrate how this trap actually activates. So here I'm, I'm mimicking how the rat takes the food away. We can see the action of the kill bar that's gonna come down and capture any of the rodents, the rats that were feeding from the bait at that time. 